It's a wonderful night for hockey. From far above center ice with Eddie Olchek, I'm Mike Emmerich. Ray Ferraro is ice side. We'll hear from him shortly. Tonight, we bring you a matchup between two great teams. Teams are just about ready. Eddie, what do you think? Two teams that have two well-crafted game plans, but once the puck drops, anything can happen, Doc, as we've seen in the past. I believe the key to this game is who stays to their game plan will win this game. He's in on an onside play. Great save. Score! He had that wrist shot ready to go in a perfect scoring area. This shot just overpowers him. He's in the right position. He stops a big chunk of it, but not enough as the puck's in the goal. Some shots, only one goal. A lot of opportunities. Love the mindset of getting pucks and people to the net. And that's a face-off win. Team Canada's carrying through along the boards. Shoots one. Great stick save. Wonderful. Wow, what a glove save. Oh, he thought he had him on the glove side. Hammering his way up the wing at center. Perfect pass. Score. And this one is tied. Especially in the offensive zone. If you want to isolate a defender, you got to get people moving over to the puck carrier to give him more options. That's exactly what happened on this play. Hiller's positioning is really good here, Edzo, but he just can't stop this perfectly placed shot. The Canadians control from the neutral zone. He's got this one, and they're after him. Terrific save, terrific opportunity. Terrific stop from right in front of the net, but you've got to find a way to put the puck in the net. His pass from the goalie. And so now a penalty will be handed out. Switzerland's roster goes down by one here. At least briefly, a minor penalty for hooking. Well, what he was trying to do is try to get the puck, but unfortunately for him, he reached in and hooked around the player. Nap by Evan. Good hustle, won the race, beat the icing. Shoots with no time whatsoever. He turned it aside. Two guys together with force. Big force. Well, guys, he did glove. There was some room. Not enough. Great glove save. The Canadians win it. Snaps off a wrist shot. Score! Yeah, that shot exploded off his stick, but I go back to the pass. Perfectly put on his stick. And so sometimes your best isn't enough. That is a perfect shot up over the glove hand. The goaltender just was not able to get to it. Canada's ahead by one goal here in the first period. A lot of time still left to play, but getting one and breaking the tie was huge. Shoots one. I can't find the target. Here's one of those times where you look at the net and there's nothing there. That's where you just got to shoot for the center of the net. The first period has come to a close, and we do have a score. It's a close game after one. You'd expect that from these two. The Canadians have an advantage of one. Look for our food donation boxes located throughout the concourse. The difference in the game is just one goal, and it came late in that period. Will it springboard to something more in the second? We'll see, but for now, we go to break. The second period here, what did you think of the opening period of our game? The Swiss are down in this game, Doc, and rightfully so. They did not manage the puck at all. If they want to get back in that game, they got to eliminate those turnovers. And in flight over the line. Breakaway! Block that one. 
Pass comes to him from the crease. A shot. Lightning in that glove. That's somebody that's been around. Deflected off the blocker. Flings it. Good work with the glove on that one. He covers and holds on. You're not going to beat a goaltender of this caliber with that shot. That's a pretty easy blocker stop. Nice face-off work. Pitching it to Borg. Moved along and in. Score! He got iron with that shot. Borg's quick flick of the wrist put this puck in from the high slot. And so sometimes you just get beat. And this is a clean shot that beats him off the post and in. The Canadians here in the second period have a two-goal lead, and it's a huge lead on the shot board. Thrown in. A giveaway. He scores! Canada, an enormous goal! Goaltender had no chance stopping that puck with the quick release. The goalie must be looking at that player wondering what in creation was he thinking. That's a terrible defensive read, and as a result, the goal is scored. The Canadians are threatening to run away with this game. Let's just see before the second period's over if there can be any kind of resistance. Chris shot. Terrific save. A shot. Missed the net. Fires a shot. A shot. Point blank save. A quick developing play right in front. Almost looks like he's too close to the goaltender. Big shot from the point. Great poke of the stick. What control. A drive. A high shot off the mark is thrown to Bay. Gets across, looks over his options. A shot, score! The goal scorer put that puck in a shooting position, let it go and beat the goaltender clean. A lot of times the goaltender feels like his positioning is perfect and he's got the net covered. Guess what? He doesn't. The Canadians have built an enormous lead and some wonderful confidence here. The coach probably won't have to say much at the end of this second period. Moving into Robbins. Snapping a pass to Lee. We've played two periods here of a three-period game. The best part of the day is coming up. Are you looking for information on the stars of tomorrow today? Check out page 21 of the program or our website for profiles on farm team members on the verge. Hiller's had days when he's been spectacular, but this is not one of those. An example there as intermission begins. Gets in, and he'll look over his options. Come right over him and couldn't get it passed. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. He gets that pass ahead in stride. Save! A little over halfway through the third. It has been more lopsided than anyone thought. Five to one. Wonderful block. Breakaway chance! And he missed it. A breakdown defensively allowed that shooter in on the breakaway, but he blew it by missing the net. He's got it on his stick perfect off that left wing. A shot. Stared him down and made the save. Howes is looking towards center from his own end. He's in on an onside play. A shot. Score for Team Canada.
Bruins decision was pretty easy this low in a slot just snap it off and he did and so this has got to be a great shot because from my angle there doesn't look like a lot of net even with the goaltender down he seems to have most of it covered goalie to the bench substitution made after a while you're not getting much from your goaltender he's given up a couple of bad goals there's been a couple that he hasn't had a chance on it is time to change the record and get him out of the game Canada's goal has taken them to an even larger lead on a night that they have had the offense going. Third period of play. Back to the point. Shoots one. He scores! Not done yet! Haas gave the goaltender no time to react with that quick snapshot. His technique is good. The butterfly is really solid. He just gets beaten with a better shot here. Switzerland's gotten one here. That's something. But they still have a big hill to climb if they're going to make this respectable. We're in the third period. Still has control up the wing. Shot on. And on to Blount. Pitching this one to Suter. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. And that's the end of the game. Well played. The Canadians have taken this game. The statistics were lopsided. Especially on the shot clock, Doc. Shoot first, answer question second. And again, we thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the evening as much as we did. For Eddie Olchek and Ray Ferraro, Mike Emmerich saying good night.